to understand what ethical behavior looks like if the lens through which you look in making that decision and, gu and guiding your actions is um, humanity, how you are a fellow human, first and foremost, with another colleague or with a guest or a customer or a counterparty, and, and secondarily as a professional. Um, so I, I think w the call to action really has been to pay attention to um, what the human response is and applying human values to help us define what ethical and responsible behavior looks like. And so we actually coined this equation, which is empathy plus action equals care. And I think a lot of people who talk about service can talk about the actions that they took. But oftentimes when you are being served by someone, if they have not practiced empathy and really can't come to understand what your needs are, it can be, um, it can, it can look fancy and wonderful, but not really purpose suited to what you actually need at that moment. I thought it was absolutely essential to our future. I thought if we can, if we can really capture this and, and allow people to make reference to it so that it becomes the animating force of all of their activities day in and day out, that we have the opportunity to differentiate ourselves in an industry where everyone and their brother is talking about serving people. We've taken every opportunity over the last five or six years to link how purpose comes to life to our commercial outcomes. And so there's no confusion in people's minds that this is not just some sort of HR initiative and cultural thing. This is actually essential to how we compete. And we are the smallest of the major multi-branded multinational companies. And we continue to perform head to head, neck and neck with our biggest competitors. And I really believe, and I think we can demonstrate that it's that special uh, focus and that special spirit within the Hyde family and, 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 our, and, and having such clarity around our purpose that it allows us to do that. So So we've defined our purpose around care. Our, our statement of purpose is to care for people so they can be their best. And I would say when we faced the most challenging decisions that we had to undertake this year, and just to be really clear and, uh, and, and quick about this, it was the uh, need to actually reduce our team size significantly. We struggled with it because how do you care for someone when you're actually terminating them from their employment? Um, why is that an expression of care? How can it be an expression of care? And, and um, we were faced with a bit of an existential uh, crisis because we thought if we don't right size our business to something that is um, this severe, we may well not have a business to actually continue, in which case we're putting everyone's livelihoods at risk. And so that sounds a bit utilitarian, but I think the, 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 uh, the, the feeling that we had was that we can apply our purpose, we can apply an ethical approach and apply our values in how we do that.